going to the SEC, it was very important that we win our season open because it just set standards that we need to win more games at home. We really wanted to um, come out and get a win for the first um, SEC opener. That's a big deal. You start to see um, the conference play off of the loss, and that just throw your whole momentum off. From Cad Smith Coliseum in Oxford, Mississippi, the Ole Miss Rebels taking on Auburn in the SEC opener for both squads. I think number one, Ole Miss has had a more difficult schedule, a tougher schedule uh, than Auburn has had. And that being said, I think they have done more with this more difficult schedule. Just about set to get started. We're underway in the Tigers control the opening tip. The Rebels are opening in man-to-man -man defense. He gave a great fake and a really quick spin. That was as good an offensive play as you're going to see by a guy in the post. The rebound is Yanari. He puts it up. No, yeah, he got it. It hung and went. Harrell's feeling it. He's hit a couple in a row now, and Auburn pushes its lead to five. <laughs> Millinghouse has 10 points, a couple of three pointers, and an assist, providing some tough defense. And in Marshall Henderson's absence, he stepped up with a solid offensive performance. 31-28, Ole Miss has the lead at the break. With a three-point halftime lead erased by an early run for the Tigers, the Rebels once again had to claw their way back. Saez cross court to Snoop White. They need some offense out of him, and they get it. It's a huge, huge bucket. 117 to play. Possession arrow is in Ole Miss's favor. Rebels with a 62-59 lead. Canada all the way to the bucket, and Jones blocked the shot. A huge block by Aaron Jones. So at worst, Auburn will need a three to tie. That'll be the biggest free throw he makes this year right there. Canada with it. Here's the three. KT Harrell, pump fake. Harrell for the tie. No. Fight for the rebound. Griffin has it. He tries to get it up. Loose ball on the floor. The hard foul. And the Rebels escape with a win. Gutsy win. You're one and zero in the SEC, and you found a way to grind it out. What I want to impress upon you between now and our next opportunity, we've got the quickest turn in the league. We got the quickest turn. We play Saturday afternoon in Starkville. All right. So we have got to hey enjoy this. But it's hard, man. Regardless of how you do it, regardless of how you play, regardless of the mistakes that eat me up, and I hope eat you up, because that's the only way you're ever correct. It, you got to win, and you got to win in a hard league. And that's the bottom line. Nothing else matters. Nothing else matters. We have to accept these new roles that we have and, and, and embrace the fact that you're instrumental in winning and losing. That's what I want. Embrace it. You diving on the floor may have, may have saved them from having another heave. And the way our luck's been all year, those heaves have been going in. But not tonight. 1-0. and Good job. Janari's MVP. Yay! They changed the game, dog. They changed the game.